I'm sick and tired of being sick and tired uh, I see the devil out here in the skies Why the fuck you out here trying to play the victim? All right, yo, what's going on, YouTube? It is your boy Q. I'm back at it again with another video for you guys. And we're just going to keep this snowball going of these vocal tutorials because it seems like you guys are kind of liking them. And if you're getting sick of these, don't worry. The next video will be a beat making video. But anyways, if you guys could do me a few favors real quick, you would hit that like button and the subscribe button just because like 50% of you guys are not subscribed yet. And I mean, if you hit the subscribe button, the like button's like right next to it. So you might as well do that. And I mean, if you're down there, if you could leave a comment and let me know what you guys think of this video or what you want to see next, that'd be great. Also, as far as social media goes, all my ads should be at Quinton Bobby on instagram twitter anything like that go ahead and follow me there if you want to keep up to date with me the discord link is always in the top of the description below and every single sound vocal preset ad lib preset anything you see in this video will be available at quintinbobbit.com that link will always be in the description as well but enough of that kid Leroy, one of my favorite artists i think he's like a super talented vocal artist i think he just has like a really good voice especially for how young he is he, but he just dropped a new album as well as the deluxe and there's this one song on the album called bad news that i just really liked and i was kind of just messing around with some vocal presets to try and figure out if i could actually get something to sound like that and i wasn't too confident that i'd actually be able to do it because like i said he's actually really talented but i cannot lie this is my most accurate recreation yet like this just turned out fire so without any further ado let's just jump into fl studio and i'll show you guys exactly how we did this i'm sick and tired of being sick and tired uh, i see the devil out here in disguise why the fuck you out here trying to play the victim all right so as always the files that you are going to be downloading if you do decide to grab this vocal preset are going to be are going to be mixer track uh presets and basically what you do to add these is you go to any mixer preset that you, or any mixer track that you have right here for example like mixer 8 just make sure it's blank you would right click and go to file and you're just going to click the file that you actually downloaded and the way you could get it into this menu right here is if you go over to this menu browser thing in fl studio over here and you go to mixer presets this is where all of your mixer presets should go i mean you could realistically do it from anywhere i mean if you have it on your desktop you could literally drag it from your desktop onto this and it'll work but what I like to do is just right click this and click system open and this will open the actual folder where they're all held and you could just drag it in here and then it'll always stay in this menu right here so for example for this kid Leroy one you just right click and I don't actually have it in here right now but you just right click the file that you downloaded boom and it would load it up and we actually have a stock option as well which is if you have FL studio you don't need any plugins at all you could literally just download FL studio and load up the stock version of this but my favorite part about this one is the waves version which just sounds so crispy and i'm telling you like you know what let's just listen to it right now so here it is right here if you haven't actually heard this song before i'd probably say go listen to that real quick but here we go this is what i uh came up with i'm sick and tired of being sick and tired uh, i see the devil out here in the skies why the fuck you out here trying to play the victim I Today I guess I realize that's how life goes. I didn't been through hell and not somebody storm. I was on a couch, I was kicked out of my home. Yeah, so there's actually a decent amount going on here. Uh, like I said, I actually think this turned out fire, but let's break it down real quick. So all I did here was I actually recorded pretty hot. As you can see, these takes are pretty loud. And basically what that means is the on my interface, I had the gain turned up a little too much. I should have turned it down, but honestly, it didn't matter too much so basically what i'm going to show you guys is what this sounds like raw so uh get ready to break your ears i'm sick and tired of being sick and tired i see the devil out here in the skies so as you can see i'm literally recording this on a hundred dollar mic and the most important part is always going to be how your vocal preset is actually affecting the vocal because i mean like i said this mic doesn't sound too good it's super boxy but with the preset bring it back onto here it sounds like this and as you can tell it sounds so much better i'm sick and tired of being sick and tired i see the devil out here in the skies why the fuck you out here trying to play so yeah what i noticed uh i think the most important part for this vocal is um i have it routed to this delay track and basically what i'm doing on this delay track is a little bit weird for some reason the delay was sounding a little out of tune for me so i actually threw another reverb on here i routed the lead to this delay track right here and i just have this delay eternity preset on here which you could literally use any delay. I, I don't know why I even chose to use this one. It's just pretty fast and simple. And also this Valhalla Vintage Reverb, which is making the delay sound like super wide and just big. And so like if I turn if I turn this delay off and we listen to it, you're going to see the, the actual vocal lead sounds way more dry. I'm sick and tired of being sick and tired. 
because all we have on it without the big ass delay that I added was just this Valhalla vintage verb. So it's it's pretty dry, but it is but as you can tell, as soon as we add this delay, it just it makes it sit with that melody like so much better. Yeah, so that's basically it for the lead. And by the way, when you download this preset, it does come with the lead and the ad lib track. And basically what you would do is go to your whichever mixer track you're using, you right click file, add the lead. It'll say like one will be called lead and one will be called ad libs. So you add that, it'll load everything up. And then you're going to select your mic, which for me is input one out of the Scarlet 2i2. You just click that and then you're going to want to make sure that on the track you just added that it says pre right here. Always make sure this says pre. It's very important. And then after that, if you want to hear yourself, it should automatically, you should automatically be able to hear yourself like as soon as you add your mic input. So yeah, you could hear yourself like that. But yeah, you could, uh, you could hear yourself with all the effects on it too. And it sounds like this. Ooh, yeah, it's lit. Yeah, the other thing that actually added a lot of depth in this was the ad lib track that I made, which is right here. And as you can see, this is with, this is the waves version, but the stock version, you'll get a similar sound. But basically what we did here is I EQ'd it like this, and then we just added a lot of reverb on there. And then it's also uh, bust out to this delay send as well. And this is what these ad libs sound like. And then we have like one over here that sounds like this. Also, something that's pretty important with this preset is you're going to want to keep your gain pretty low on this because um, all the compressors are set with the threshold being pretty low. I mean, you could always adjust it if you want to, but if you uh, actually want it to sound exactly like how we did, you're going to want your gain to be pretty damn low to the point where when you're singing into the mic, the decibel reading on it should only be somewhere around like, like minus six at the highest. So that's all I got for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Like I said, I think this turned out by far like the most accurate I've ever had. Like this preset is just super crisp. I also really like how the ad libs turned out. Yeah, if you guys actually want to go grab this, you know where to go, quintababa.com. I'll have the link in the top of the description below. And then also in the top comments, that'll be the pinned comment. But yeah, that's all I got for now. If you guys could do me a favor and leave a comment letting me know what you want to see next, that'd be great. But yeah, that's all I got. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. I'm sick and tired of being sick and tired. I see the devil out here in disguise. Why the fuck you out here trying to play the victim? But today I guess I realize that's how life goes. I didn't been through hell and not survive the storm.